Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Manuel. Good evening, Carlos, Delmi, Martin, Alexander. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you tonight? Good night. Hello, everyone. Good night. Welcome to the class. How are you today? Fine, same. And you? I'm excellent. Thanks for asking me. Manuel, how are you? Welcome to the class. Manuel, I can't listen to you, Manuel. Yes. Ah, okay. Now I can listen to you very well. Uh, how are you tonight? And you say, I'm fine. I'm excellent. I'm great. I'm perfect. I'm very good. And Carlos Mauricio, how are you? Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. I'm fine. Okay, yeah. that's great. You are fine. So welcome to the class. And Marixa, how are you tonight? Hello, good evening, teacher. Good evening. So it's a pleasure to meet you tonight, guys. Um, thanks so much. So my name is Everoldines Nieto Perez. And for this English course, I am going to be your facilitator. So anything that you need, you can ask me, right? I am here, I am here to help you uh, to learn this beautiful language. Uh, I'm pretty sure that you are here because you like English, right? Raise your hand if you like English. Levanten la mano todos los que les gusta el inglés. Ah, okay, I saw it. That's yes. why we are here because we like this a beautiful language. Uh, Marvin Alexander, do you have a question? Ah, okay. No, no. Estaba levantando su manita virtual para decir que le gusta el inglés. That you like English very much. No. <laughs> And that is nice, right? Um, so we are going to start tonight, right? The beginner three. Este es el curso, ¿verdad? Um, principiante 3, ¿verdad? So, welcome. Welcome. So, as I said before, my name is Ever. So, you can call me Ever. You can call me teacher. Right? So no problem with that, right? There isn't any problem. So, how would you like to be called? ¿Cómo les gustaría que le llamáramos? Miss Francisca, Mr. Carlos, Miss Marixa, uh, Miss Delmi. Or for your name. You say yes, Carlos, Manuel, Alejandra. ¿Cómo les gustaría? Manuel. Okay, by your name, so Manuel. Okay, that's great. Hi, my name is Idalia. I like that they call me Idalia. Okay, okay. We say, we use the phrase, you can call me. You can call me, okay? You can call me. You can call okay. me, Idalia. That's great. Call me. You Anybody? can call me, Delmi. Okay, Delmi. Thank you so much. Anybody? Ok, so let's start with this class. Antes de comenzar, ¿verdad? vamos a ver los lineamientos generales del curso. Eh, bienvenidos a todos una vez más. 
y vamos a estar acá todo el de, bueno, de lunes a jueves, ¿verdad? A excepción de algunas semanas que hay días festivos, ¿verdad? El día del trabajo y el día de la madre, que vamos a recibir clase los días viernes para recuperar esa hora eh, que cayó en el día de azuelo. Eh, tengo problemas con el internet, dice Alejandra María de Osorno. Ok, I understand. Don't worry. Eh, bueno, let me share with you the presentation. Eh, we are going to start with this. Bueno, lineamientos generales del curso. Eh, solo de que me compartir acá. And let's start with this. Okay, I am sharing my screen with you. Can you see it? Estoy compartiendo mi pantalla con ustedes. Pueden verla, me confirman, por favor. Yes. 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 Ah, okay. Thank you so much. So let's start with this. Uh, tareas y evaluaciones, right? So es necesario tener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones. Para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente, ¿verdad? Esa es la nota mínima. 80%. Ok, pero nosotros no estamos acá por un 80%, ¿verdad? Vamos a llevarnos el 100% de esa plataforma, ¿ok? Que esa sea nuestra meta, ¿verdad? Desde hoy, que es el primer día, hasta el último día de clases que tengamos, ¿verdad? Vamos por ese 100%, ¿verdad? En todas esas tareas y evaluaciones. Y... No se preocupen, ¿verdad? Yo estoy acá para ayudarles. Yo les voy a estar recordando, ¿verdad? Que necesitamos hacer ese trabajo en la plataforma, que necesitamos hacer esas actividades, que necesitamos tomar esos exámenes. Entonces, yo voy a estar acá pendiente, ¿verdad? Si usted necesita ayuda, algún ejercicio difícil, ¿verdad? Si hay algún ejercicio difícil por ahí de hacer, ¿verdad? acá estoy para ayudarles con mucho gusto. No, las tareas se encuentran ubicadas en una plataforma, ¿verdad? Este ya es su tercer curso. No sé si alguien eh, hizo el examen de nivelación y entró de una vez al Beginner 3 o todos hicieron con nosotros el curso 1 y 2. Beginner 1 y Beginner 2. Yes. Yes, ya están familiarizados, ¿verdad? Con la plataforma. Yes. ¿Cómo son los ejercicios? ¿Cómo van los temas? Eh, en la plataforma, aparte de los ejercicios, usted va a encontrar una retroalimentación. ¿verdad? Hay videos explicativos de cómo debe resolver los ejercicios. Entonces, todo eso está alojado en esa plataforma. Se recomienda que se trabaje en la plataforma después de cada clase. ¿verdad? Pero usted puede ir adelantando contenido. ¿verdad? Si usted siente que un contenido ya lo domina o que está un poco entendible, un poco fácil, usted puede ir adelantando ¿verdad? sin ningún problema. Y... Todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completos antes de cada viernes, de la medianoche, ya que ese registro se envía a Insafor semanalmente. Entonces es importante que vayamos haciendo nuestro trabajo, que no se nos vaya acumulando. Ya han habido cursos en que nos toca, ¿verdad? Un día antes de finalizar eh, el módulo, eh, estamos ahí, ¿verdad? Recibiendo mensajes. Mira, ayúdenme con el ejercicio tal. Mira, me hace falta tal ejercicio. Entonces, no dejemos todo para última hora, ¿verdad? Yo sé que a veces este, el tiempo, ¿verdad? No, este, no nos deja, ¿verdad? Porque tenemos otras ocupaciones. Pero ahí entre esas otras ocupaciones vayamos apartando un ratito para ir completando esa plataforma. Para que al final, ¿verdad? No nos toque una maratón. ¿verdad? Nos vamos a develar todo hasta la una de la mañana llenando el ejercicio. Entonces, no permitamos que eso pase. ¿verdad? Entonces, vayamos eh, cada semana, semana a semana, vayamos completando los ejercicios para que no se nos acumule ese trabajo. Y material de apoyo, ¿verdad? Es, es a criterio del profesor o del facilitador. Se comparte de manera digital en el grupo de WhatsApp. En caso de que necesitemos ejercicios extras o alguna página web extra, yo se las voy a estar compartiendo por el grupo de WhatsApp. Si ustedes necesitan ayuda, eh, si tienen alguna pregunta, ahí está en el grupo de WhatsApp. ¿verdad? Va a ser un gusto poder ayudarles. Let's go with the next thing here. 
Ok, uh, tareas y evaluaciones. Esta es la programación, ¿verdad? Si está programado que eh, llevemos este módulo en la semana número uno, which is this one, week number one, we are going to work in section one and section two. En esta primera semana vamos a trabajar en la sección uno y sección dos. Eh, week number two, semana número dos, sección tres, en mi turn. La sección número tres y su examen. Eh, semana número 3, week number 3, section number 4. Ok, la semana 3, vamos a trabajar la sección 4. En la semana 4, que es la semana final, vamos a tener la sección número 5, section number 5, en final exam. Y el examen final. En la right? Do you have any questions with this? Preguntas hasta el momento. Questions? No, teacher. No question. No, no question. Okay, that's great. That's excellent. Let's continue then. Um, okay, this is important, right? Here are some rules, right? Uh, while we are in classes, we need to follow these rules para que la clase sea más ordenada. ¿verdad? Y vamos a seguir las siguientes normas de convivencia. Y primero, ¿verdad? Después de cada participación, asegúrese de silenciar su micrófono, ¿verdad? Y nombre completo, debe de tener su nombre completo, y cámara encendida, participación activa, uso de chat, levantar su manita virtual si tiene preguntas y siempre mantengamos el respeto, ¿verdad? Y si nos equivocamos, eh, está bien, ¿verdad? Los errores son parte del proceso y no tenemos que burlarnos de alguien porque pronunció mal o porque le faltó una palabra, o porque dijo una palabra de más. Entonces tenemos que mantener siempre el respeto durante la clase y durante las participaciones de cada uno. ¿eh? So, please, respect each other in this class. Eh, let's go with this one. Asistencia, política de asistencia, tiene que cumplir con el 80% de las clases virtuales. ¿eh? Eh, Avance y desarrollo de la plataforma de aprendizaje. Eso es muy importante, ¿verdad? Que usted vaya avanzando en los ejercicios de la plataforma de acuerdo a los temas que vayamos viendo. Incluso puede ir adelantando. Como les dije anteriormente, no hay ningún problema. ¿verdad? Eso usted se adelanta. El inicio de clases es today, ¿verdad? 17 de abril y finaliza el 12 de mayo. Eso significa que el 11 de mayo ¿verdad? nuestra plataforma debe de estar completa. Un día antes de la última clase Debe de estar completa nuestra plataforma. Eh, todo terminado, todos los ejercicios resueltos, los exámenes realizados. Eh, our schedule is from 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. So it's last six, 60 minutes, right? We are going to have 60 minutes of class every day. And then you have to work on the platform exercises. Usted debe de trabajar en los ejercicios en la plataforma y al final usted va a obtener su diploma. So, esos son los lineamientos generales. No sé si quieren agregar algo, tienen alguna pregunta o algún comentario. No, no question. No, no, no question. No questions. Okay, so let's know each other. Just give me a second. Muy bien. Vamos a conocernos un poquito más, right? Uh, so we are going to get personal information, right? Para que nos vayamos conociendo. ¿Hay alguien conocido ya con quien llevo el módulo 1, módulo 2 en este grupo? ¿O es primera vez que están en un grupo juntos? Is this your first time together? ¿Ya conocían a alguien del grupo? No, ok. Nobody, okay, that's great. So let's give some um, personal information about us, right? Let's see, for example, uh, hello, good evening, everyone. My name is Ever Nieto. It's nice to meet you. I am from Cojutepeque. I'm from Cojutepeque. Um, I am 34 years old. Alejandra says, I'm new in this group, okay? So any, anybody, anybody wants to share information? ¿Alguien más quiere compartir información? 
So say your name, where are you from, how old are you, and how do you feel tonight? Y cómo se siente el día de hoy. My name is Manuel. I live in San Martin. Uh, I am foreign foreign I get us all. Excellent. How do you feel tonight? Solo le faltó una. ¿Cómo se siente el día de hoy? How do you feel tonight? Uh, happy. Happy. Okay, that's great. Nice to meet you, Manuel. Welcome to the class. Anybody? Anybody? One, two, three, four, five. Any volunteers tonight? Me. Uh, thank you, Gabriel. Hello, everybody. Good evening. My name is uh, Gabriel Salaya. Uh, can you tell me Gabo? I live in San Martin. Um, I am 36 years old. My, my hobby is uh, listen to music and I watching TV and always uh, I exercise and I feel uh, happy. I feel too happy. Okay, thank you, Gabo. That was an excellent. So, Gabo had some hobbies too, right? También él agregó unos pasatiempos ahí, ¿verdad? He likes watching TV. He also likes doing exercise. And he likes listening to music. That's great. Thank you so much, Gabo. So, you can call him Gabo. Thank you. Uh, Francisca Idalia. Uh, hello. Uh, good evening. My name is... Francisca Idalia. Uh, I am uh, 41 years old. Uh, I'm from El Salvador. Uh, I am studying English, uh, Principian module, 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 beginner, beginner module, three. Beginner model three. three. Uh, three um uh, I love uh, reading and playing basketball uh, my favorite uh, food is um uh, fish fish eso teacher okay excellent very good thank you so much okay listen la frase que utilizamos cuando terminamos nuestras presentaciones es that's it. Ok, that's it. Para decir, eso es todo. ¿no? Ya no voy a decir that's nada más. Sí, sí. That's it. Esa es la frase that's que vamos a utilizar. Ok, uh, excelente. Thank you. Okay. That's, that's it. Ah, oh, Francisca también agregó favorite food. ¿Cuál era la comida favorita de Francisca? What is Francisca's favorite food? Fish. Fish, yeah. fish it is, very good. Any volunteer? Any volunteer? Anybody want to share personal information with that? Anybody? One, two, three, four, five. No volunteers? Okay, let me see then. I'm going to choose somebody there in my screen and I'm going to choose here. Raul Edgardo, can you please? Yes, teacher. Thank you My so much. My name is Raúl Eduardo. I'm from Soyapango. I am 33 years old. Mm -hmm. My hobby is exercise. Okay, My thank you so much. Oh. It's for your compare. Oh, yes. Uh, that is delicious, right? It is delicious. Thank you so much, Raúl. Very good job. Any volunteer? Campero chicken. Anybody likes campero here? Nobody. I prefer el campestre. Okay, okay, okay. Teacher. Uh, yes. Teacher. 
Visit, Me mandó el... visit Restaurant Buenavista. Ah, Buenavista, Andar es ah, eh, Las Pavas Hill, en el Cerro de las Pavas. <risa> yes, I have gone there like three times. It's a cute place. It's very nice. It's a very nice place. Thank you, Manuel. Eh, anybody? Bueno, dos más, dos más. And we are going to start with the class. One, two, three, four, five. Any volunteer? Any volunteer? Come on, come on. Anybody? No volunteers? Then I'm going to choose somebody. Uh, let's see. Ana Lucia, can you? Good night. <laughs> uh, my name is Ana Lucia Nieto. Uh, my very happy is to play music. Um, my favorite food is pupusas. I am 40 years old. Um, solamente, <laughs> perdón, como dijo que se, que se, que se decía al final. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's okay, it. excellent. Uh, you say, I like to play music. ¿Significa que usted toca algún instrumento musical? Yes. Yes, ah, okay, piano. that's great. The piano, that's excellent, very good. Bueno, wow. luego de las clases de inglés nos quedamos en clases de piano con Ana Lucía. <laughs> okay, that's excellent, very good. Ah, Alejandra María, ah, solo le estaba mandando un aplausito ahí, ¿verdad? Virtual. Thank you, that's excellent. The last one, the last one, ¿quién salva el curso? El último, ¿quién salva la clase? The last one. One, two, three. Yo digo que Carlos Mauricio quiere. Do you want, Carlos? Good evening. Good evening. Eh, my name is Mauricio, bueno, Mauricio Navas. Eh, uh, favorite food is Beef eh, eh, and I I like I like play football basketball and I am a forty three year old year and. That's it. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much, Carlos. Uh, you say that you are 43 all years. Uh, we say al revés, years old. All three. I am 43 all three. years old. Okay. Yeah. Okay, the rest was excellent. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. You are so brave, right? Eh, muy valientes todos los que participaron. Congratulations. Ah, yo sé que cuando no conocemos un grupo de personas es bien difícil, ¿verdad? Eh, aunque sea de manera virtual, nos ponemos nerviosos, ¿verdad? Si estaba yo cuatro minutos antes de las nueve. Ay, dice, ¿a quién voy a conocer el día de hoy, verdad? Pero es un gusto conocerles, ¿verdad? It's a pleasure to be with you here tonight. So, thank you so much. You did an excellent job. Bueno, y los que faltan, ni crean que se salvaron, porque tenemos 16 clases para que se puedan presentar. Todavía no están a salvo. Incluso al final de la clase podemos escoger a otros. So, thank you so much, guys, for your work. And let's start with this. Uh, do you like birthday parties? ¿Les gustan las fiestas de cumpleaños? Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. yes. What do you like most? ¿Qué es lo que más les gusta de las fiestas de cumpleaños? The dancing. Ok, the dancing. Alejandra dice the food. Do you still like piñara? Do you still like piñara? Yes. Hit the yes. piñara. Ok. Yes. Sí, que marica, me desahogo okay. dándole la piñata. Ah, piñata. The ah, okay. K. Ah, the K. The K is the least okay. too. Bueno, pero lo más importante de un cumpleaños es que uno sea el cumpleañero, ¿verdad? Porque recibe, ¿verdad? <ríe> Do you like presents? Do you like presents? ¿Les gustan los regalos? Yes. 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 
Okay, uh, money or socks and underwear. Money. <laughs> money. <laughs> okay, let's think about birthday. Uh, let's think about your birthday. What is the best thing that you have ever received? ¿Qué es lo mejor que ha recibido en su cumpleaños? Any volunteer? What is the best thing that you have ever received in your birthday? Un carro, teacher. Una vacaciones a Miami. A piano. A piano. Oh, a new piano. That is great. Viera, teacher, a mí un viaje a culo me regalaron. Pero bueno, algo es algo. Anything? Cones and kiss. Ah, ok. A, a hug and kiss. Abrazos y besos. Ok, that is pretty important too, right? Uh, let me see what is in the chat. Let me read the chat. Um, the food, money. The best present that I received was my favorite perfume. Ok, your favorite perfume. That's great. So tonight, guys, we are going to learn to talk about the date of our birthday. So let's see. When is your birthday? That is the question for tonight. When is your birthday? ¿Cuándo es su cumpleaños? When is your birthday? So, let's start with January. ¿Alguien cumpleaños en January? January, January. The first month of the year. ¿Alguien es de enero? Nobody. Let's see, February. February. Anybody yes. is from February? Yes. Yes. Okay. February. Marvin yes. Alexander. Okay. Okay, and Manuel, which one? Fifth of February. Okay, in February too, we have two. What about March? March? Nobody? April in this month. April? Me. Me? Okay, Gabo, Gabo and Marixa. And anybody? March? Oh, sorry, April. We were in April. Carmen April. Elena too? April, okay, excellent. What about May? March, Carmen Elena is in March. In May, nobody is from May. What about June? July, August, September? July, my July. Okay, your birthday is in July. In July. That's great. Uh, uh, let's see, July, August, August. Nobody is from August. September, September, Independence Day, September. Nobody, October. October, Alejandra Maria Lemos is from October. Okay, that's great. Uh, okay, now let's see, November. November. Ah, okay, Ana Lucia is from November. 18. And finally, December. 18, 18. Okay, 18. 18. Jose, ah, Raúl Edgardo is from December. Okay, great. ¿Cuál será el mejor mes para cumplir año? December. December. July. July. Okay. Bueno, dicen por ahí que los lo de enero no nos dan nada, ¿verdad? Los que nacimos en enero, pues, se gasta todo, ¿verdad? Al final del año ya no queda para ganar los de enero. Pero ya no. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see how to answer this question. When is your birthday? ¿Cómo vamos a responder esa pregunta? So let me share with you the presentation. We are going to learn that. Um, I am sharing with you my screen. Can you see it? Okay, thank you so much. So this is the topic for tonight. When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Any volunteer to read this question? ¿Quién quiere leer esta pregunta? Any volunteer? When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Okay, excellent. When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Then, let's see. My we are birthday. going to start with months. ¿Ya todos se pueden los meses del año? Yes? Yes. What is? Yes. Okay. What is the first one? January. 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 What is the tenth? What is the tenth? Uh, 
10 October. 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 Ah, okay, excellent. What is the fourth? April. 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 Oh, what is the 12th? November. 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 December. December. Ah, okay. December. 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 Okay, great. Okay, December is the 12th. So let's yes. let's see the first one. What is this one? Did you say? January. January, yes. Um, let's see the next. February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. June. July. July. August. August. September. September. October. October. November. November, December. December, ok. Después que llegamos a agosto, ya me alegraba, ¿verdad? Cuando me lo estaba aprendiendo, ya son septiembre, octubre, noviembre, diciembre. Ok, the easiest one. So, we have January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Let's, let's listen to the pronunciation. Escuchemos la pronunciación y then we are going to practice, ok? So, let's listen. Oh, just give me a second. Okay. Months. Can you listen? Months. Can you listen the audio? Yes. Yes, yes. yes. that's excellent. Yes. Months. January. February. January. March. April. May. June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Okay. Any volunteer, any free person to practice, to read all of them? Any volunteer who wants to help me? I can. Oh, thank you, Raul. Go ahead, please do it. January, February, March, April, <laughs> March, June, July, August, September, <laughs> October, November, December. Okay, almost perfect. Very good job. No, that was great. Bueno, okay. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. bueno, vamos a silenciar antes que nos enojemos con ellos. <laughs> También. <laughs> Thank you so much. So, the last two, July, July, and August. July, okay. August. Okay. July, July, and July. August. Okay. okay. Thank you so much. Anybody, the last volunteer to greet the moms of the year. Who the mask? Quien salva la clase? Who say me. the class? Thank you. Who say me? Me. Oh, I have two. I have two volunteers. Okay, <laughs> ladies first. Ana Lucia, do it. Okay. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. September, October, November, December. Okay, excellent. Very good. That was great. That was perfect. Thank you. Eh, who said me? Okay. Antes de Ana Lucia, alguien dijo, me. yo, teacher. Me. Can you please me. Say, say me and your name? Por ejemplo, me, Carlos, me, Eric, me, Juan, please. Okay, me, Gabo. Ah, okay, excellent, Gabo, thank you. Okay, uh, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Excellent, thank you. Get an applause for your classmates. Very good job, that was great. Excellent. Then let's go with the next. 
Uh, ya tenemos la primera parte para responder nuestra pregunta. ¿Cuál era la pregunta que vamos a aprender a responder? When is your? Is your birthday? Ah, ok. Ah, when is your birthday? Bueno, ahí ya cada quien escoge su mes, ¿verdad? January, February, March. Ok, then my birthday is. And then we are going to add on. My birthday is on. My birthday is on. Y luego vamos a decir el mes, ¿verdad? Pero nos hace falta algo. El día es específico que nacimos, ¿verdad? El día específico de nuestro cumpleaños. Eh, para eso utilizamos ordinal numbers. ¿Cuáles son los números ordinales? ¿Quién se acuerda? Ordinal One. numbers. First. One, two, two three, three, four, five. Um, those are the ordinal numbers. Third. Ah, okay. Fourth. Eh, okay, excellent. Those in English and in Spanish we have ordinal and cardinal numbers, right? Se van a acordar la clase allá por séptimo grado, ¿verdad? Se les viene a la memoria porque estaban yes. estudiando. Yes, second. <laughs> oh, yes, those are ordinal numbers. When you say first, second, third, fourth, fifth. So let's start with this. Uh, veamos. Eh, Ana Yasmin, do you have a question? Francisca? Question? Uh, yes, teacher. So, eh... Quiero ver, ¿cómo digo? Uh, how do you say quiero participar? I want to participate. I want participate. Okay, I want to participate. I want to participate. I want to participate. Le fal uh, faltó el tú. I want to participate. I want to participate. Now it's perfect. Very good. I want to participate. ¿En qué parte? My en birthday, los meses. My birthday. Ah, ok. Tell me, when is your birthday? My birthday is the first of December. Ok, thank you. Okay. Eh, thank you so much, Francisca. En Ana Yasmin, what is your question? Uh, Deseo participar, ¿cómo es? I want to participate. I want to participate. Okay, tell me, when is your birthday? Uh, my birthday is 7th of July. Okay, 6th of July? 7th. 7th, okay, 7th. Okay, now let's see. And we are going to study ordinal numbers y después vamos a ver el orden correcto. ¿Dónde va el mes y dónde va el día? But let us start okay. with ordinal numbers. Thank okay. you so much for your participation. Very good job. Excellent. Tienen un punto extra en la plataforma. For your participation. Thank you. So let's go with this thing here. Yeah. Any volunteer to read this? First, <clears throat> second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Ah, teacher, ¿y por qué esos cómo son diferentes de los otros números? Ah, los primeros tres is different. We say first, second, third. Los otros se parecen muchísimo, pero al final tienen esa TH que vamos a tener que hacer ese sonido. Fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Al final del sonido del número 6 vamos a tener que hacer el sonido eh, para hacer este sonido nuestra lengua va en medio de los dientes you say 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 ok that is the difference now let's go with the next part we have 11 12 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th, 20th. And then we say 21st. Let me hear this. 
we say 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, and 31st. Y esos son todos los días que tienen los meses, pues hasta el 31. 31st. 31st. Dates. First. Second. Can you listen the third. pronunciation? Yes, please. Okay, so let's listen the pronunciation of this. Dates. First. Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth. 20th, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, 31st, Okay, now you know the pronunciation of the ordinal numbers. So let's go with this. Let's practice then. Let's practice this ordinal number. Anyone want to with the first one? How do you say this number? Eighteenth. Eighteenth. Thank you. Let's see the next one. Twelve. Twelve. Okay, we say twentieth. Twenty first. Excellent. What about this one? Thirty first. 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 Thirteen. 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 El mes y la fecha exacta. For example, this one, June 15. June. What about the June. next one? January. 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 Okay, January. excellent. What about this other one? December. Okay, okay. Let's stop here. December 25 or December 25th. 25th. December 25th. Ah, okay, excellent. That's perfect. What about this May, one? May. 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 11. May 11. 11. 11. Excellent. And the 11. next one? June. July. July. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, let's start here again. Is it July or July? July. 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 Uh, July 20th. 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 July 20th. 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 
Uh, okay, that is uh, 21st. And what about this one? September. 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 October 31st. Excellent. Thank you. No. November 2nd. Ah, okay, that was perfect. Very good. And this one? March. 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 First. First. Okay, excellent. Now let's see when is your birthday. That was the question, right? When is your birthday? And then we are going to answer in this way. We are going to say the special day. Then we are going to use the verb be plus on plus the month and plus the day. Let's see, for example, my birthday is on January 31st. And then, when is your mother's birthday? My mother's birthday is on December 16th. When is your father's birthday? My father's birthday is on February 20th. 20th. Okay, so uh, to answer this question, we are going to say the special date, the verb to be, the preposition on, the month plus the date. Okay. Now let's see if I ask okay. you when is your birthday, then you are going to answer my birthday is on January 31st, for example, right? When is your okay. mother's birthday? Then you say my mother's birthday is on December 16th. When is your father's birthday? My father's birthday is February 20th. Okay, now let's go and practice. Any volunteer to answer this question? When is your wife's birthday? Los caballeros que están casados, when is your wife's birthday? Anybody? Yes. yes. Uh, tell me, when is your wife's birthday? Then you say, my wife's birthday is on... My wife's En este caso serían solo los caballeros, ¿verdad? El cumpleaños de mi esposa es. Anybody? My wife birthday is on January 1st. Ok, excelente. January 1st. Excelente. Okay. ok, Manuel, tell me. When is your wife birthday twenty-seven? Mm, okay, then you say my wife birthday birthday is on is on is on uh, April April, April twenty-seven twenty-seven. Excellent. My wife's birthday is on April 27. That is a perfect answer. Thank you, Manuel. Great job. Let's go with the next one. Now, is this for ladies? When is your husband's birthday? When is your husband's birthday? My husband. My, my husband's birthday is. On August um, August twenty-six. Okay, excellent. My husband's <laughs> birthday is on August twenty-six. Six. Perfect. Thank you. That was great. Any other lady to answer this question? When is your husband's birthday? Me. Me. Okay, me, tell, tell me. me. Uh, my husband's 
Okay, July 22nd. Perfect answer. Thank you. The last one. When is your husband's birthday? I want to participate. Thank you so much, Marixa. Tell me. My house there, uh, birthday is February 2. Okay, very good answer, but we need to fix something there. So my husband's birthday is on February 2nd. Okay. okay, my husband's birthday is on February 2nd. Very good participation, thank you. Let's go with the next one. -da -da -da. Best friend, do you have a best friend? Todos tienen mejor amigo? Best friend, when is your best friend's birthday? Y se van a enojar sus amigos cuando vean el video. Se acordaron de la fecha. When is your best friend's birthday? My I want to participate, my... teacher. Okay, thank you. Tell me. Um, my, my best, best friend. friend' birthday is on April 6th. Okay, excellent. On April 6th. Perfect. Thank you, Carmen and Elena. Thank you so much. Any other volunteer? When is your best friend's birthday? Hello, hello. Ah, Alejandra Maria Lemos on the chat says, yes, my best friend's birthday is on Me September 21st. <laughs> That's great. Then let's see, anybody? Uh, the last one, Ana Lucia. Ana Lucia. My best friend's birthday on August 4th. My best friend's birthday is on August 4th. Perfect answer, thank you. Let's go with the next one. This is an important day. Uh, when is your brother or sister's birthday? When is your brother and sister your day? Anybody? My sister's yeah. birthday is on January um, 9th. 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 Okay, <laughs> excellent. 9th. Perfect. Let me see. Alguien más levantó la mano. Francisca. Teacher, my best friend birthday is October 10th. Okay, excellent. Very good. On October 10th. On October 10. Okay, Thanks. excellent. Thank Gracias. you. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, then let's see the next one. When is your mother's birthday? When is your mother's birthday? Anybody? When is your mother's birthday? One, two, three. Any volunteer? My mother's birthday is on December 10th. Thank you, Anna. December 10th. My Anybody? mother, my mother is birthday on November 26th. Okay, perfect. Thank you. November 26th. And I have one chat here. Let me read it. My brother's birthday is on September 18th, and my mother's birthday is on February 9th. Perfect, Alejandra Maria Lemos. Thank you. Thank you for your participation. Anybody? The last one. When is your mother's birthday? My mother's birthday is on June 28th. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Then let's see the last one. Your father's birthday. When is your father's birthday? When is your father's birthday? My father's birthday is on September 21st. September 21st. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Ana Lucia. Very good. Thank you. My father's birthday is on September 
Nine. Nine. Ok, perfect answer. Thank you. ¿Será cierto que a los hombres se nos olvidan estas fechas importantes? Yes. La gran yes. mayoría. <risa> Anda, compré una partida de nacimiento. Le digo, sí, pero anotámelo en un papelito. Ven, si <risa> Ok, ok, that happened, right? Now let's see some special days um, in El Salvador. So we celebrate this, right? Independence Day, Mother's Day. Uh, Valentine's Day, Teacher's Day, New Year's Day, and Christmas Eve days. But the question is, when is? When is in El Salvador? Or when is Independence Day in El Salvador? When is um, Independence Day in El Salvador? September. On September. September 15th. September 15th. 15. 15. Ah, okay, 15. excellent. Independence Day is on September 15th. And Mother's Day, when is Mother's Day in El Salvador? May. 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 Okay, excellent. Mother's oh, Day. Oh, May. Oh, May. May. Oh, May. Oh, May. Oh, May. Oh, May. Oh, May. May. May 10th. Okay, excellent. Thank you. What about sign Valentine's Day? February. 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 14th. 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 Ah, okay. El Día de las Flores y los Chocolates. San Valentine's Day. <laughs> and Teacher Day. Teacher's Day. June. June. Yes. Teacher's June Day is on June 22nd. June. Okay, excellent. 22nd. Teacher Day is on June 22nd. And what about New Year's Day? New, New Year's Day. New Year's Day. New Year's Day is December City. On June 22nd. Okay, are you sure? New Year's Day, December 31st. Ah, okay, then we are going to check the answer, but there is a, there a trick there. Christmas Eve Day, Christmas Eve Day. December 25th. 24th. December 25th. 20th. <laughs> 25th. Ah, okay. Okay, ¿qué día nos comemos el pan con chumpe? 24. Oh, 24. Okay, 24. that's great. <laughs> and Alejandra Maria says Independent Day is, is on September 15. Yes, you are right. Uh, okay, now let's be here. New Year's Day es el día de año nuevo. ¿Cuál es el primer día del año nuevo? New Year's Day. January 6th. Okay, right. excellent. January 1st. Entonces, ¿cómo se llama el 31? New Year's Eve. Así, New Year's Eve. Eso Year's es como vísperas, ¿verdad? Vísperas del año nuevo. Lo mismo sucede en el número 6, en el número 6. Christmas Eve Day. Oh, Christmas Eve Day es la víspera. El 24 nos desvelamos esperando que sea 25, ¿verdad? que es Christmas. Ok, Eve, entonces significa vísperas. Christmas Eve Day. Ok. Then Christmas is day, it's on December 24. Let's see the answer here. Independence Day is on September 15th. You were right. Mother Day is on May 10th. Sign Valentine's Day is on February 14th. Teacher Day is on June 22nd. New Year Day is on January 1st. And Christmas Eve Day is on December 24th. Four. Okay. Let me see. Um, let's practice with this. Um, two volunteers to practice in this conversation. I need two volunteers to practice tonight in this part. Two, two volunteers, two over a person. Now me, okay, teacher. Two. Let me see. I have Francisca me and teacher. Carmen Elena. Okay, Francisca, Carmen, Elena, and then we are going to choose another two participants. Francisca, you are going to be A, and Carmen, Elena, you are going to be 
B in this part. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Carmen Elena, what is your favorite month? Uh, my favorite month is March. Okay. Why do you why do you like Julie? Ah, no, um, sería, sería su nombre, Carmen Elena. <laughs> Me? Yes. Why do you admire? Because Julie? because the water is hot and it is my birthday. Nice. My favorite month is August. August. Why do you have a birthday in August? No, why I have vacation. Good reason. Ok, excelente. Okay. Los, los meses favoritos del año donde cae la vacación. August, April this year, or March sometimes. Ok, thank you. Let's okay. go with the mix. Very thank good. You. What is your favorite month? ¿Cuál es tu mes favorito? Es decir, my favorite month is July, March, April, June, July. And why? Why do you like this month? ¿Por qué le gusta ese mes? Then you say, because the weather is hot and it's my birthday. Okay, nice. Thank you. Let's go with the next. Any other two volunteers to participate yeah. in this conversation? Hey. Okay, tell me, thank you. I have tell me and who say me? Escuché un caballero. Hey, Gabo. Oh, Gabo, thank you. Tell me and Gabo. So tell me you are hey. A, Gabo, you are B. Hey, hey, Gabo. Yes. Gabo. Yes. Hey, Gabo, will you come to my birthday party? When is your birthday party in Luis? It's on May 2nd. That next month. No, is it next month? Yes, it it is Lisa. We are in April, and the next month is May. My okay. name is <laughs> Okay, thank you. I le yo lo que estaba bien. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay, thank you so much. Excellent job. Thank you. So, will you come to my birthday party? ¿Vendrán a mi fiesta de cumpleaños? Bueno, si nos van a invitar a toda la clase. Will you come to my birthday party? Say, when is your birthday party? It's on May 2nd. That's next month. No, it is in next month. Yes, it is, Lisa. We are in April and next month is May. Great. Uh, the last two volunteers to practice in this last conversation. The last two volunteers, I have Ana Yasmin and Ana Yasmin and any volunteer? Okay, let me see. I have another one. Ana Yasmin. Uno más, un voluntario más. ¿Quién salva la clase? Ya has to finish the class. Uno más. Thank you, Marvin. Uno Me? más. Nos Me? vamos a descansar. Okay, Manuel, in the second round, uh, we are going to listen Ana and Marvin in, at this time. Y después escuchamos a Manuel. Okay, let's start, please. Marvin, can you please start? Okay. When is your birthday, Freddy? It's, uh, um, it's all ours. Uh, 31st. 30, 30, 30. 30 That's the same day as Halloween. No, it isn't Halloween, it's on October 31st. No. 31st. 31st. I see. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. So do you have any question? Now you can answer the question, when is your birthday? Uh, let me see. Okay, 
Antes de que nos vayamos, voy a preguntar a algunos de ustedes. O oh, Carlos David Argueta, when is your birthday? Carlos, Carlos David, when is your birthday? My birthday. Uh, My birthday is on August. Le faltó la fecha, the date, August. No vamos a saber qué día, igual le regalo. August 10th. Ok, excellent. Uh, let's see, Carlos Mauricio Navas. Uh, when is your birthday? My, my birthday is on August 20th. Ok, 20th. August 20th. 20th. Thank you very much. Carmen Elena, when is your birthday? Um, <clears throat> my birthday is on March 5th. Okay, perfect. Very good. And let's see. Ta, 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 ta. Gabo, when is your birthday, Gabo? My birthday is on April 19th. April 19th. Okay. Sí, todavía vamos a estar en el curso. Vamos a poder cantarle a Gabo. That's great. Okay. <laughs> it, it is in two days. Excellent. So... Prepare happy birthday to you. Todos le vamos a cantar en la clase. That's excellent. And the last one. Let's see. Ta, 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 ta. Who's the last one? Claudia Palacios. When is your birthday, Claudia? My birthday is April 12. Okay, excellent, Claudia. Algo le faltó a Claudia. ¿Qué fue? It's on. Ah, le faltó la preposición on. My birthday is on. Ok, but very good. Thank you. Thank you, Alejandra María Lemos. It's on. Ok, guys, thank you so much for your participation. No sentí hasta ahora. Creo que acabamos de comenzar y ya terminamos. Thank you so much for your participation. I really like your feeling, please. Thank you. Thank uh, you, please. Teacher. Uh, don't forget about the platform, right? So, todos tienen acceso a la plataforma. Ya revisaron que sí pueden ingresar, si sí le funciona el usuario y la contraseña. Nobody has yes. problems. No? Yes, teacher. Ok, yes, that's great teacher. then. Then no, we can no, already no. start working Thank on the platform. Thank you, teacher. Good evening. Good night. Good night, teacher. Ok. Bye bye. See you teacher. tomorrow. See you. Bye. Una pregunta. Teacher. Uh -huh. Dígame, ¿cuál es su pregunta? Uh, al inicio pasó lista. Uh, ok. Solo déjenme descargar la lista. Ok. Acá. Ahorita sonría. Voy a tomarles una captura. One, two, three. Ok, that's great. Ah, ok. Carlos no estaba. No iba a salir. Ok. So, one, two, three. Here we go. Ok, thank you so much. Eh, no se les olvide la plataforma, ¿verdad? Ya podemos empezar a trabajar en ella y avanzar en los ejercicios. Thank you so much. Have a good night and see you tomorrow. Bye, bye. See you, bye. Bye. Good night. Bye, bye. Good night. Good night.